Here we go, Pokemon Next walkthrough, second gym video. My biggest impression from the second gym is that, God, it took a long time to get to. Holy crap. Was anyone else out there wondering, like, which of these cities that I'm gonna pass through has the freaking second gym? I felt like I went through two or three and they just weren't there. I'm like, this is great, you got an aquarium or whatever. Where's the second gym? Jeez. Now during that time, they were throwing all sorts of Pokemon at you, and being the Pokemon trainer, I felt like catching them. In fact, I almost wonder if this period of the game was designed on purpose to give you a whole bunch of Pokemon to build a well-rounded team. Now, I'm not saying six Pokemon, I'm saying like 20, because they just kept throwing them at you. They also gave you the experience share, which in this game, I did not realize this, meant that everyone in the party could get that 50% cut. So there was never a reason to turn it off. I definitely had issues at this point keeping my starter at a reasonable level. Eventually I just, I just left him in the computer altogether for stretches and there'd be parts of the game where I would field like six relative rookie Pokemon that were at a fairly low level with like I mean, maybe I had like one in there that I knew would do okay. And I could just train them up because all the Pokemon I had to fight were under leveled. So why wouldn't you be able to just train a whole bunch of Pokemon at this spot? I had a lot of Pokemon in my team at that point in time. I caught a Pikachu, I was using that. I caught a Haunted, which seemed really, really cool, I was using that. I caught a Flabebe, if that is the name the fairy Pokemon that I figured would be pretty important in the long run. I definitely caught one of those. Did I have any understanding that you could choose which color Flabebe was? No. No, I did not. So I ended up with a yellow one, if you are curious. I definitely think at this point in the game, too, I realized that it wasn't probably gonna be that hard because they were just giving you certain Pokemon. You'd be, like, going through the field and they'd be like, Hey, you want this ghost steel thing? It's pretty common. You're like, I, I guess. You're like, hey, you want this second starter? And I'm like, okay, fine. I'll take the Charmander, of course. Eventually, they're like, hey, you want an Axew? Like, a dragon? Really? Already? They're like, yeah, you know, we got the fairy thing, so the dragon's not that big of a deal anymore, even though it's a pretty powerful Pokemon. You're like, I guess. I mean, that would be the theme that I would find in the game, is that they would just give you things. Later on, they'd be like, here's a Lucario, here's a Lapras, here's this other dragon Pokemon. Are you sure you don't want a Gibble? Are you sure? This is definitely where it started for me to notice they're like, oh, they're giving you a lot of stuff. By the time I got to the second gym, I don't think it really was that, all that hard at all. In fact, I'm forgetting what it is in, in general, but... By the time I got there, I certainly had my fair share of all sorts of different Pokemon. I had like probably three strong fire Pokemon by itself at that point in time. I got, you know, the Charmander, the flying firebird thing, and even the fire lion, which I even then I noticed had some pretty strong special attack. Now I think at this point of the game, you meet the bad guy, and he's pretty obvious that he's a bad guy, and you can even tell by his haircut what kind of Pokemon he has. In comparison to other bad guys, I think he's fine. He's certainly not quite as memorable as some of the world-destroying dudes in the past. I mean, he wants to destroy the world, yes, but... I mean, if he's not PETA and he's not the really creepy dude, it kind of doesn't compare. It's kind of an odd thing to be like, I want the world to be pretty. I want the world to be pretty. It's an interesting motivation. That's pretty much all I have to say about this second part of the game. I'll catch you on the flip side for the third part and the third gym.